Hello everyone and happy February I guess. Why am I so zoomed in? So this video is going to be like a days in my life in lockdown. It will probably only be a few days but I thought it would be interesting to show you the interesting things I don't do. I don't know. I like vlogs like this so I thought I would do one. Today has been kind of slow. Um, it's I've just had lunch. It's like half past one. Um, it's really gloomy and it's not the nicest so I've only done a few things so I went to post a Depop parcel and had a really slow morning. Um, I didn't have any plans for sort of like the rest of the day but I have received a package of some fabric dye. Um, it just looks like this. It's supposed to be lilac. It looks quite dark um, but it's fabric dye because I want to dye my white converse lilac they're now cream and not white and they just look really dirty all the time and i don't really reach for them so i was like maybe i'd reach for them more if i dyed them so i'm going to see what color it turns out so this is like hand dye um so i literally don't know how i'm going to do it because like i swear we don't have like any buckets but i'm going to do some googling on how to dye shoes properly because obviously they've got like the white bit but hopefully i can do that this afternoon um, because I don't really have anything else to do. Normally I like to like get up and then like go for a walk or like do something out but it's so cold and gloomy today I just didn't want to. So like I said I, I like posted that debug parcel got that all sorted out. Um, I also want to hunt for some more stud earrings so I, I want to do that and um, I should plan some February videos because I've only got like two ideas so far um so i need to be thinking about more ideas so i am going to start researching about this and then um i'll probably like show you my shoes like a before and then i will show you what it looked like it doesn't look like very much um but i don't want it to be that dark anyway so i'm sure it will be enough you can put these ones in the washing machine but because the converse have like all the white bits like the logo and stuff on it um i don't want to do that because i don't want it all purple i just want the fabric bit purple so these are basically what the shoes look like now they are clean um because uh i've put them in the wash and i haven't literally worn them since then um because that just shows how much i wear them i mean not that i really go out of the house and if i do it'll be on a walk so i'll be wearing wellies anyway but um this is what it looked like. I'm hoping that because they're sort of creamy, it won't make the colour go really weird. But and you see, like, like I tried to bleach them, but it just still stayed this like yellowy colour. Um, so I'm going to take the laces out, and then I watched a video that looked. Pretty I do say so myself. I mean, basically, she had two um, sinks. One was full of the dye, and then one was just warm water, laundry detergent and like table salt and she basically um, put Vaseline all on the white part, the like rubber parts so that didn't get dyed and then dunked it in salt water, then in a dye and then back, back and forth. Um, so that's basically what I'm going to try and do. If it doesn't work out right, it's not the end of the world because this is just an experiment and like if say these shoes got ruined it wouldn't be the end of the world so. Good so alone sometimes it starts to make sense on this side of paradise we're never concerned when the grass always greener on the other side of the screen and misery set her sights on the likes of you and me when I rose alone you pulled from my chest When white mask of tragedy Tells ribbons round the neck And then shadows to cast Over beds that we've made And you start to forget Why you came to this place Then you go Break the being left on here to dry i've just got a towel just in case any color drips off um but i mean doesn't look the worst color from here 
I mean, it's not bad colour. It's just not the colour that I wanted. But I'll hopefully update you when they're actually properly dry. Basically, what I'm doing now is watching Grey's Anatomy. There's no information is useless information. Yeah. It's, both of you are wind up merchants. My favourite cod, pod, cod, podcast has put out a new episode and I'm kind of annoyed because um, I don't go on Instagram in the morning. I didn't know that it was out um, and I probably would have listened to it on my walk but um, it's a nice half an hour episode and also this is about sustainability and we love that. Um, so after lunch I'll probably listen to this whilst doing some colouring in or something. So it is now the day after I dyed these. These are basically how they have turned out. So they are not purple at all. They are blue. And um, honestly don't think I would mind the colour. But for some reason it's just brought out all of the dirt marks even more. And so there's like random brown slodges on them. And there's also like when the dye's gone weird. Um, I'm not going to totally blame the dye because I didn't use the methods um, that they said should be used. Like I didn't do it on a stove top which was the most recommended um, because I thought it was like hand dye. Um, so I think what I need to do is research different dye to use because I really want to try again. Um, and maybe something that will clean them properly. Um, I have tried bleach before and it hasn't done enough. But like, it would be a decent colour if it didn't have all the marks on it, I don't know. I'm going to just put them on anyway with the laces and see what they look like. Ignore the socks that <laughs> don't really match. But this is basically what they, what I've just got one on, what it looks like on. Obviously it's not awful and it is perfectly wearable. I just don't like all the splodges like this I just think it ruins it um so I think I'm now gonna do some research into dyeing shoes properly because I feel like maybe I just jumped into it rushed into it but um hopefully I'll be able to find some stuff to be able to make these actually how I want them so um I think what I am gonna do is listen to oh pretty bright see I also like sitting here and doing stuff in the sun I'm going to listen to Dada pod and do some colouring in. Colouring in has been one of my favourite pastime activities this quarantine and time not spending on my phone type of thing. So I forgot I had this colouring in book. It's called Miri Marotta, it's Animal Kingdom. Um, it's basically like a colouring book with like plants and animals, um, but they're all like, it's supposed to be like an adult colouring book. They're all really intricate so like this is one that I've done it's an octopus um, and like these fish and like they're all kind of showing you best as I can I was working on these giraffes um, at the moment so I think I'll probably finish this little page off I just don't like Dana. I was like, Hi. what? I need to get into Yes, no. And at some point we will do some like fun tears tests, but... Hello everyone, so today this morning... Okay, I'm really hyping this, but this really isn't that exciting. I basically have to... I hope you can't hear the... Um, every time I want to get into my car and it's like a two minute journey, everything's always all steamed up. So 
for all the condensation. But I have to take my car for its MOT today, so I'm just starting it here. It's happening. Oh, okay. Turn it off. So it's basically like a place that's like two minutes down the road, so I've got to drive it there and then I'll have to pick it up later. Um, hopefully it passes. But then I'll have to walk back. It's like a 20 minute walk back, so. Um, I'll get like a cute little walk out of it, so that's how I start this morning, it's like half ten. Um, so, I'm just going to take everything out of my car though because I feel like I need to reevaluate what's in it anyway. That's basically what I'm doing this morning. I just sold something on Vinted for the first time. Um, I actually really much prefer Depop the way it sells because it doesn't give you the money straight away. Um, a bit weird, but... Um, I'm actually just going to go place it now and I'll probably just have a little walk sort of like around the meadow as well because the sun, the weather's gone really nice. It's cold but it's really nice and sunny. <laughs> like did a thing where I just picked four colours at random because I can't ever decide what colours to colour stuff. I'm also watching Grey's Anatomy and I'm still waiting for my MOT to be done. I sorted out all my car stuff so that's just all the stuff I've got to put back in it um, and it's still super sunny. So my car successfully passed its MOT um, so I've just got back from picking her up and she's all good. Um, but I just got back from that. So, and I also, one of my, my middle fingernail broke off like last week and the other side one's just broke off. I don't even know if you can tell, I don't want to flip you off, but these two are shorter than all the others and they were all like the same good length. It's really annoying. But I think what I'm going to do now is just sort of make them all good. Um, and sort them all out and then i'm also going to see my dad this evening and have tea with him so i'm not going to be vlogging that and i was only going to do like a few days anyway so i think i am going to all the notifications end this vlog here so if you have enjoyed it don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you'd like to see more of these because let's be honest i'm probably going to have time to make more um and if you really enjoyed it you could subscribe and I will see you next week for a brand new video.